It's time to witness the wetness. This is Innuendo Bingo. Please say that Foxes is joining us today. And I, I don't know about you guys, are ready for quite a wet one today. Are you? You feeling it? Very much so. <laughs> so you're right, uh, you right there? You right? Yeah. I'm, I, I feel the nerves. Don't be nervous. Uh, people get nervous, it's just spitting water. I might grab a hoodie, is that allowed? No. No? You. I wanted a, you know, when you go to a theme park and it's, you get the waterproof, oh, the poncho. massive poncho. Yeah, no, that's for losers. Yeah, we, we can't have ponchos on this game, sorry. Good. Okay, get online now, bbc.co.uk slash radio one. Foxes are about to play in you and a bingo. I've got a feeling it's going to be a good one. It's you can even watch on your phone. Oh, you're going barefoot for this? Yeah, I'm going in. That's not a bad idea, actually. Take them um, off. Nah. Do you often go barefoot or just for when you play silly games? Uh, um, I'm barefoot most of the time. Like Dana Vickers. <laughs> 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 oh, okay. that's deep. So, first... We are going once again to BBC Local Radio. This time, BBC Newcastle. Right. And Wait, what's it? Ready? Civilised. Yeah. 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 Loads of water, please. Oh, God. Here we go. Oh, God. It's quite cold, by the way. When it first hits you, it will mm. kind of take your breath mm. away. Just, just to warn you. So, BBC Newcastle. And this builder, after making a lot of plans indoors, is just a little bit too excited to be outside. All great fun when you're at meetings, sat around a desk in a porter cabin, but standing out on a bracing day like today in the field with this huge erection <laughs> is fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, okay. Easy. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> oh, 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 stop it! <laughs> Oof. It's and we're fine. live. Please do not swear. No. No, it's all fine. So that was uh, BBC Newcastle there, starting us off. Huge erection. I did tell you there was a shock. <laughs> okay, he's erected a brand new building there. I'm very excited Come about on. it. Come on, don't I'm give up on us. Fine. I'm not crying. Here we go. Don't cry. Water. Thank uh, you, Jack, yeah. for emailing that one to us. <laughs> that was seriously... It's, a, it's hard to explain until you're here, isn't it? It's mm. cold and it's in your face. Mm -hmm. Now... <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Mm. Are you back? Come okay. On. Now, the problem is, BBC Local Radio, they're at it all the time. Now, here's a classic from Down Norway, BBC Radio Solent. And Sam Fraser is always happy to tell her listeners... Whatever's on her mind. I've got some loads of stuff booked. We're going to do um, Broadway. We're going to see Phantom of the Opera. Um, we're going to a Red Sox match when we're in Boston. And I have every intention of getting one of those foot-long sausages in my mouth. Uh, I don't think it'll be a problem. I've been told I've got a big mouth. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good job I'm not wearing a white T-shirt. <clears throat> Sam oh Fraser there on BBC oh. Radio. So. Do you need more? Yes. There you go. More. Okay. Oh my. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's fine. Now Come you on. you've got your head around it now, haven't you? Let's go. It's just the shot. initial yeah, shock. The, yeah. Just no. I'm in shock. Okay. This is... And now we're going over to a play on Radio Four Extra. He's so good at it. Cheers. He is good. It's just real get it, get him back. Practice. Mm. Okay. Ready for extra? Now here's a charming scene in this play where a man and woman are exchanging gifts. And the surprising thing isn't the gift itself. It's where she gets the gift from. That's very nice, she said. And look, I'm going to give you a little keepsake too, just between you and me. It was a small silver box that she drew from her muff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's no. What was happening there was it was winter and her hands were cold. Um, Have you ever got anyone in the face as much? Uh, oh, yeah, every yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. Tuesdays and Thursdays. Silver box that she drew from her muff. Gerard emailed that one to me at uh, scott.mills at bbc.co.uk. Are you right there, love? I can't see. It's okay. Oh, Plow on. Now we've got Sir Tom Jones on the voice. Water, please. And here is Zoe Ball managing to produce a kind of shock admission from Tom. Good chance this year of winning. To me, it's, it's the strongest team because I've put myself into those people. <laughs> no. He does work very closely with the performers. Mm -mm. Mm. Okay, that's fine. Swallow that one. 
Joe in Loughborough's doing his dissertation, but it has broken off for um, for a bit of bingo. I think that's allowed, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is exhausting. Sh- I know. Sean and Ryan in Dingwall have been on as well. Now we cross over to this week's Embarrassing Bodies on Channel 4. Mm. And here's Dr. Christian with one of the show's female experts. Now, I know you get to see quite a lot on that programme, but surely this is a first. I am yeah. starting to go slightly now. Okay. Yeah. I don't think I can actually bear that much so either. Oh. Right, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh. Oh. There we are, Dr. Christian there on Embarrassing Bodies, <laughs> testing out an ice cold bath. Oh, dear. Okay. This is a good one. Yeah. Katie you know and what Tom. I keep doing it, just really stupid. What's up? Like trying to go closer to you, so I'm getting your face, but yeah. it means that I'm getting more of the spit from your mouth. You're, yeah, because yeah, you're yeah, moving yeah. closer to him. That's not the way to do it, is it? Just sit back and enjoy it. <laughs> yeah. Katie and Tom in Cambridge were watching that one. Hi. <laughs> You're looking really good, to. though. Oh, yeah. This you is are. My, this is my best look, yeah. No, but it's always interesting seeing who looks good wet and who um, yeah. and who doesn't. Some people look better wet. Yeah. And uh, now to a uh, daytime quiz show. Is it all right? I thought, yeah, imagine. Just freaking. Water? Yeah, yeah, we're, we're ready. Daytime quiz show, perfection next. And I wonder what the question was here, because... There were some really unusual answers on the board on this quiz. Remember, if there's one single mistake, you leave with nothing. Which ones are worrying you? Um, Little Willie's worrying me. Um, and Fanny Craddock is worrying me. <laughs> God. We think that round was it's about really old TV cold. chefs. It's I don't cold know. Today. <laughs> is it cold today? <laughs> it's cold. Your makeup's running. Oh, no. oh that, was, that, was, that was a real dark. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, cheers. Go online and watch bbc.co.uk slash radio one. Fox is on. A classic from Spring Watch now. And Michaela Strachan. She is always at it as well. Here's Michaela explaining a new bit of technology which allows them to film something that they have never, ever shown on TV before. Some of the birds that have usually fledged by now, we can get cameras on. We've got cameras on great tits. Bird watchers really like great tits. Magnificent creatures they are too, beautiful. And finally, to Radio 4. <laughs> and this is a really enticing reason to go and check out this show's Twitter feed, I think. This is the last one. Yeah, you ready? Right, really, really top up for this one. <laughs> Get it all in your mouth as much as you can. <laughs> Try Loads of water. Yeah. I think, oh, and wow. spray. Okay. Spray him. Right. Ready for four. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. And the weather. Rain will move eastwards across the UK, reaching eastern parts by the evening. You can find out more about the programme by going onto Twitter, where there'll be some pictures of my jam. <laughs> Follow. <laughs> and that was... That was in you in the bingo. Foxes, how do you feel? Wet. Yeah. In the face. Yeah. 